What do email developers actually do? Just copy and paste? <laughs> Let's get into it. All right, guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, codingphase.com. Your boy is back and I done did it again one more time. Make sure you subscribe and show me some love in the comment section. So again, this is a good question because a lot of people don't understand the job of an email developer. So again, let's go and answer this guy times. <laughs> he said, what do emails developers actually do? Pasting contents into templates and messing around? So let's start by explaining what email marketing is and how it benefits businesses. So I'm pretty sure you guys have seen, you know, your promotional tab that's right here on Gmail, right? And in other different platforms, right? And you receive emails, something similar to this, right? This is karmaloop.com. They sell clothes. And guess what? Whenever they have some new products that are coming out or some new sales that's happening, they go in and email you. And most of the time they email you two to three times a week or even more. And that's to notify you on anything that's happening on the store. Now, this is an article that came from campaignmonitor.com, which is one of the best resources for email developers and email marketing, right? And it says basically that, in fact, the average click-through rate of an email campaign is around 3%, where the average click-through rate for a tweet is 0.5%. So again, you're more likely to get more results through emails than even advertisement or social media. And just to prove it to you guys, let's look at the numbers and how important this is for businesses. I'm gonna pull up the calculator. So let's say right now you have, right, 100,000 email contacts from customers that are, are interested in your product. Now you go in and say, well, 0.03%, right? is going to be uh, basically the people that actually click on it. So that's gonna give us 3,000 people. Now out of those 3,000 people that actually clicked on the email and they went to your website to purchase, let's say you're getting a 4%, right? 0.04, right? That's 120 people that will purchase your product just from one email. And let's say you have that product, which could be around I don't know, let's say $100 a pop, just right there on that single day, on that single email campaign, you could easily make $12,000. And we're talking about really low numbers. There's companies that got higher conversion rates, better email lists, where people are more warmed up to be able to sell to them. So their conversion rates might be even higher. So you might be making, you know, maybe 50, $100,000 per email. It's possible, right? There's a lot of companies that have different products and different type of prices for each product, right? Of course, somebody selling something that's $10 and somebody selling a $1,000 product, it's a big difference, right? So as far as profit. So yes, this is something that's very important for businesses. Now that we understand the value that we bring in as email developers to companies, let's talk about what the process is, right? There's campaigns that are planned by marketers, right? There's people who are specialized in coming up with strategies. Now there's designers who create the design, the look of it, the feel of it, the type of typography. Is it a Black Friday sale, is it a Halloween sale? What type of colors are we gonna have? Christmas, etc. right? There's designs for every type of campaign. Now, guess what? We developers, our job is to make this actual email that they created and make it into a reality, okay? Make it into a real email that people can actually see and the browser can go in and, and show them, right? Same thing with all the different type of email clients that's out there from Gmail, Microsoft, Outlook, right? AOL, Yahoo, there's people still using Yahoo Mail. Yes, so yeah, we gotta go in and make it into a reality. Now. We don't just stop there, right? That's the part of HTML, CSS that we handle when we create the templates. But behind that, there's also a bunch of other things that need to get done. For example, if you're using services like Salesforce, Klaviyo, you can set up automations. Did this person come from let's say the online store, did this person come from an advertisement? Did this person sign up to a newsletter? Does this person sign up to being uh, you know, notified on a pre-order? 
Does this person, you know, purchase a product online? Do we now send them a transactional email? What type of products that person likes? Not only just the emails, but also creating the landing pages. So when somebody clicks on an advertisement and they land on a specific page and they have to have a certain information on that page, we build that. We connect that page to the email service providers. So there's a lot of things that's going on that is on the technical side that we handle. So it's not just, hey, copy and paste and just put it up there. You're actually doing a lot of technical work. Now, is this JavaScript? Is this doing animations? Is this doing a backend? No, we're using tools to set up all of the automations that need to be done for these campaigns to actually run smoothly. So yes, we are just as important as the front end developer who creates the website, the back end developer who creates the APIs and the user authentication, the mobile app developer who creates the apps that the people get to purchase products on, on their mobile phones, or maybe, you know, sign up to the services. We are just as important as those parts from the development because we are creating the marketing tools that allow people to go back into those apps and use them or purchase products. If the emails are not good and the emails have not been tested and the right automations haven't been done and set up, it don't matter how good your application is. If no one knows about it or no one knows what products you have, how are you going to be able to sell that? So yes, it's a very important job. Now guys, I hope that I answer your question on what an email developer does and how much value that email developer brings to companies. Now, if you are interested in learning the skills, you are a beginner, right? Somebody trying to get into the industry, becoming a developer, there's really no better place than codingphase.com, guys, okay? Pretty much we help you master web development step by step with our program. You can come in, check out the platform, right? We have a lot of good students that have gotten hired and a lot of major companies following the strategies and going through our curriculum. Everything that we teach here is with a realistic point of view of how to get you into the industry. It doesn't matter if you're in your 20s, your 30s, your 40s, your 50s. We can help you come in switch careers and get you into your entry level job positions and hold your hand through the process of going through your second, your third, your fourth job, right? Pretty much your whole career at coding phase. Okay. So definitely go check it out. Links is going to be in the description. You can actually get a really cool discount when you click on the link on the description. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.